Guys and gals, ladies and gentlemen, how do you get more ideas for making YouTube videos? Well, as we all know, vlogging, it can be pretty awesome. And it can also be draining. Um, it could be fun. It could feel like really lonely, like you're just isolated from everybody because not everyone in your, your atmosphere is a vlogger. Uh, it could be exhilarating, you know, when you're vlogging out in public and you know that you've got some exciting footage. Um, and sometimes vlogging can be pretty tough. Let's face it, vlogging, it's not easy. It can be quite challenging to make videos that make, uh, make people happy, that make them sad, that make them laugh, that make them cry, um, that teaches them something, that enlightens them. YouTube is a great platform uh, to, to share your thoughts out there uh, with the rest of the world, world, with the universe. And you can also find out what other people are thinking uh, about the topic that you're talking about or what they think about your thoughts. Um, it's even a cool place to get into a, a really good argument as a lot of you have already seen on YouTube. Uh, it's very active as far as people commenting on a, a really hot topic. Uh, but every now and then sometimes ideas can be very limited. Uh, especially if you've created so many YouTube videos before covering uh, numerous topics. Um, this could lead to an extreme setback though called procrastination. Uh, when we have a lot of YouTube ideas, we get excited, right? We get motivated. But if we do not have any ideas, then we lose motivation. So, And sometimes we wait too long to make the next video. I remember watching the Hodge Twins uh, not too long ago, and they were talking about, they usually talk about fitness stuff, and they actually started talking about a topic that they talked about before. That's, you know, it was a, like a repeated topic, and the title was very similar to what they, t uh, a title that they used before also. But, you know, they were being transparent about, about being redundant and, Luckily, those guys are entertaining, so it's not really a big deal, but it happens. It does happen. Uh, you gotta get those creative juices going. Writers, you know, they get writer's block from time to time. Vloggers are gonna get vlogger's block. And that's something that you want to avoid. It's an art form. Vlogging is an art form, like poetry is, painting, music. A common video topic though, uh, now that it comes to mind, that you could talk about if you're low on ideas, a common video topic is you could talk about how to get more ideas for your YouTube videos. <laughs> so there's some zen everywhere, right? So, but with all sincerity, it can seem very impossible to get creative when you are on a, on a empty tank and as far as video ideas so one way to get creative get the creative juices flowing is just walking it out sometimes I'll go for a walk and it clears my mind and you know I'm not like walking around looking for flowers to smell and listening to the birds and stuff like that but just walk go for a little walk you know just walk it out clear your mind get some fresh air and get those creative juices flowing and you know, let's say you got a bum leg, go for a ride in the passenger seat of your best friend's ride. And a lot of times the passenger seat can be very therapeutic. Like you're moving forward, you don't have to worry about driving. And that forward momentum can help your brain just get activated. And a lot of times the passenger seat can, it's, it's almost like a therapy chair. You just start venting, 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 venting. And a lot of times, that's how couples get into arguments because they're in the car for long periods of time, and you're like forced to talk things out, you know. So maybe sometimes arguments are good, but you definitely got to just walk it out every now and then. Walk it out. Another thing that you could do is study your history, study your video blogging history. Which one of your videos have had the most success. Are you able to elaborate on that particular video topic and 
create subtopics uh, for that one. So think about that. Think about that. Can you give more clarification? Can you create a mini series? And that's going to lead to more ideas. So there's a reason that we study history, study our own personal history, look at the statistics of our our vlogs, vlog performance, stuff like that. Also, you could lean on me or them. What I mean by that is just talk to your friends, talk to your family. You could talk to other vloggers if they're accessible. That's why you network, and that's why I created a inner circle, the vloggers inner circle, and we will get to that more about uh, upcoming um, events for you guys and programs and and you know some cool stuff, cool gifts that I want to send your way for being in the vloggers inner circle. So definitely call someone. It's not a crime. You like to make videos. And you know what? So do many other people. And your friends probably know that you love video vlogging. So call your close friends and family members. Get some ideas from them. Ask them what you could do better. Ask them what you are doing that is inappropriate. But you have to be ready for any possible constructive criticism. Ask them for ideas and suggestions. A possible end result is that you might have a new vlogging buddy. Wouldn't that be cool? Just having a new vlogging buddy. Um, someone, you know, kind of like having a workout buddy or a restaurant buddy. Is someone to vlog with all the time. And the great part about the whole vlogging thing, you're not really consuming. You're sharing, right? You're sharing. You're providing uh, some type of value to other people out there watching your, your videos. So in a way, vlogging is money saving um, because you're not spending money when you're, you know, it, when it's your hobby or it's your passion, you, let's say you've already spent money on the camera or whatever, but on that day, you didn't make any purchases purchase just to shoot a video blog. You're actually saving money, getting your money's worth from the technology that you have. So blogging is, is it's a healthy activity, in my opinion, for many, many reasons. So, yes. You also have to talk to your peoples, your subscribers, your viewers. Find out what your subscribers and viewers want to watch. This will also contribute to the interaction, the interaction with the community that you joined when you started your YouTube channel, or maybe you're thinking about starting your own YouTube channel. If the comment section on any of your videos is active, then the search search engines will rank your video higher than your other videos that have the same or similar topic or content. Um, you know, there's other factors as well, such as advertisement, subscriber lists, and marketing. So the comments and the activeness there, that's not the uh, be-all, end-all, but it is a factor that can help your, your video's performance. So at the end of the day, make sure you are being social that you so that getting video ideas from your viewers will be 10 times easier. Guys, if you have not done so already, head over to thrivecrunch.com and check out the Vlogger's Journal. You gotta read it. Lots of good advice that uh, I'm going to, that I'm sharing with you. And also the Vlogger's Journal, it's a live organic ebook. There's constant updates and revisions and changes. And when those revisions and changes are made, you are going to get a new copy um, every single time. There's no monthly payment. There's just a one-time small payment. And it's like measly dirt cheap. So it's definitely worth it. And you will get your money's worth and you will definitely enjoy reading it. It also comes with a lot of other cool stuff like um, you get one hour personal coaching on the topic of video blog blogging to help you get your uh, vlogging performance through the roof and you get access to the VIP vaults, the vloggers VIP vault. So make sure you follow the link in the description of this video and you know start your journey, continue your journey as a vlogger and make progress. Alright guys, peace out.